Good morning, everyone. Welcome to this week's Victory Kids message. When I was in high school, I used to run races, ran track and field, and my race that I would run were sprints. One of them was called the 100 meter dash, literally 100 meters. It was a very short distance, but you tried to run it as fast as you possibly could and cross the finish line before everyone else did. But let me ask you this. How do you think I would have done in those races if the whole time, that whole 100 meters while I was running, I was doing this? How do you think I would have done in that race that required me to go as fast as possible if the whole time I was running, I was looking around, I was looking at the people running in the lanes next to me, I'm looking up at birds in the sky or grass on the ground or looking at my feet as I'm running on the track. How do you think I would have done in that race? Probably not very well, right? Because if I was looking all over the place, I wasn't paying attention to where the finish line was. And if I'm turning around and I'm looking or I'm looking behind me if, to see if anyone's running behind me still, that's going to slow me down. Right? You can't run as fast if you're turning your head and your body back and forth. And if I'm looking up at the sky or I'm looking at the grass, I'm not paying attention to where I'm going. And that means I might swerve into a lane next to me, run into another person, or I might trip over my own feet or a rock on the track or something. So the best way to run that race was for me to keep my eyes focused ahead, to keep my eyes focused on the finish line. When our reading from God's Word this week, Jesus tells us that our life is like a race. He tells us that we need to run our race with perseverance. We need to keep on running, but the race of life is not a short sprint. It's a long marathon, right? There's a long life that God gives to us. And he warns us that there's a lot of things that are going to try and distract us from running that race. There's distractions. There's a whole bunch of stuff that maybe is going to happen in your life that's going to try and pull your focus away. There's going to be bumps in the road. There's going to be sin. There's going to be other problems that are maybe going to jump up and trip you up as you're running your life as a Christian. You know what Jesus says? He says we need to fix our eyes on him. Just like the best way for me to run that race was to keep my eyes focused ahead on the finish line that I was racing toward, God tells us that the best way for us to run our lives here in this world is to focus our eyes on Jesus. See, when we keep our eyes focused on Jesus when we're running our lives, we're not going to get caught up in the distractions of this world. We're not going to veer off the course and run into something else or get into trouble. When we keep our eyes on Jesus, we know where we're going. We know where to follow. We know the direction that God gives us in our lives that we should live. We also look to Jesus because the, for the times where we don't always keep our eyes ahead, where we don't, sometimes we do stumble and fall in sin and distraction and we lose sight of what's most important. So we look to Jesus because we know he's our savior and he's taken away our sin. He tells us that when we keep our eyes focused on him, then one day we are going to cross that finish line, not at the end of 100 meters, but the finish line of when our life comes to an end in this world and we've reached the finish line of heaven. When we keep our eyes focused on Jesus throughout our lives and we know with absolute certainty that we are one day going to cross that finish line and be in heaven with Jesus forever. What a beautiful thought, right? So as you're running your race, as you're living your life, always keep your eyes focused on Jesus. Let me read the passage that we're talking about today for you. This is from Hebrews chapter 12. Therefore, since we are surrounded by such a great cloud of witnesses, let us throw off everything that hinders and the sin that so easily entangles, and let us run with perseverance the race marked out for us. Let us fix our eyes on Jesus, the author and perfecter of our faith, who for the joy set before him endured the cross, scorning its shame, and sat down at the right hand of the throne of God. Why don't we pray and ask that Jesus would help us to keep our eyes focused on him as we run the race of our lives. Dear Jesus, in life there are so many distractions, there are so many stumbling blocks or things that try and get in the way as we try and live our lives and run our races with you in our sights. Help us to avoid those things. When we do stumble and fall, help us to get back up and look to Jesus for forgiveness because we know that that's what he came to be, to be our Savior who is willing to endure the cross so that he could give us eternal life. Help us in thanks to live that way, to keep our eyes focused on Jesus and everything we do. 
knowing that when our faith in Him is strong and when we keep our trust in Jesus throughout our lives, then we know with absolute certainty that one day we're going to cross that finish line and be with Him forever in heaven. Help us to do that, dear Lord. Help us to keep our eyes always focused on you as we run the race of life. We ask it in Jesus, our Savior's name. Amen. Thanks for joining me this week, friends. God bless the rest of your week and keep your eyes always focused on Jesus.